In a harrowing attack by Hamas terrorists, Ayel Young, an Israeli Spurs fan, defended his home and family, sustaining gunshot wounds in the process. Young, who works for a defense company, recounted the events from his hospital bed in Beersheba. He described waking up to the red alert alarm and rushing his family to the safe room. Sensing something different about that morning, he grabbed his phone, despite religious restrictions, and prepared to protect his kibbutz. As the attack unfolded, Young witnessed the slaughter of 17 Thai nationals and cared for injured Nepalese. He and his fellow guards engaged in a dangerous battle with the terrorists, resulting in Young being shot in the cheek and shoulder. Despite the chaos, Young's wife and children stayed in the safe room for 26 hours, enduring the terrifying ordeal. Young's story highlights the resilience and determination of the Israeli people in the face of terrorism. However, he also expresses disappointment in the lack of recognition from the football community. While the Football Association and Premier League have announced gestures of support, there has been no acknowledgement of the terrorism Young experienced. He believes that football should speak out against racism and treat all communities equally. In a small boost during his recovery, Young received a video message from Tottenham's Israeli winger, Manor Solomon. The message brought comfort and positivity during these difficult times. Young, a lifelong Spurs fan, reminisces about visiting White Hart Lane and the new stadium, sharing his family's passion for the club. Living so close to the Gaza Strip, Young describes his home as 90% paradise and 10% hell. Despite the challenges, he remains committed to fighting for a normal life and returning to his home. Young's story serves as a reminder of the strength and resilience of the Israeli people, and the importance of unity and support in times of crisis.